here we have my new NR model, my third one in this month. These cost $216 and takes Toy Shop in Chavin Avenue in Geelong, Victoria. In our locomotive is on the side. No star model. These are no stars like on the real life model. In our five in the PN. DC power. I'm pretty sure this will be a DCC ready model. How there's a trick with these models to get them out of the box. You just grab the two plastic ends like that. Be carefully and pull it up and it will take the, the foam board off. Um, you could be saying there's something missing to the f for the protection. There's always something missing because I took all disposed of the foam um, for a reason. The rest of my lugs have the foam on them. But I've had a terrible discovery with the foam today. The foam and the side of the loco, both sides of the loco was covered in hair today. I disposed of the foam because it was covered in hair and cleaned the loco. Or I just blew on the loco and it all the, the hair came off the loco. It was on both sides actually. I don't think there's any more shards of hair on there. There bloody is too. Right there. Let me get rid of that quickly. I'll get rid of it later. This side, guys, but here on the loco once again. So let me check some more on this side. But that's only half the problems of it. Half the only problem I know of it. There's even more on the bogies as well, so let me clear that out. See, it's a bit hanging off the wheels. The camera's not going to pick it up. Right here. I'm not going to see it because it's so thin. But this logo is covered in here as well, so I might have to give, take the bogies apart, clean them out, and probably restore the bogies because they're all it's coming out the bogies as well. That's another term for the wheels and I'll stray and talk. But here's the logo. It's a nice model actually. Here's the front. And I also said above the cab NR, but my hands like steady hold it steady, but it says NR8. Yeah. It's all five chime, Nathan no. I think it's Nathan five chime. I'll have the number of the horn now. On that side. And that side. This is a take two of the unboxing, cause take one was an absolute failure because I said NR5. I guess I'm trying to focus that camera on there. There you go. Nathan five time horn. I filmed a and two NRs at Little River, two at um, a crossing on the Moorable train line. With when I went with my friend. And two one at two at seven I think three at seven cross. And um yeah, it's a 207 cross, yeah. I'm hoping to film NR8 one day. I do really have a video of this running, so I unboxed it early today. So I've got a video of it running with my other two NRs. So there's the loco, it looks really nice. Matt Trains has um, filmed NR8 at North Shore Station on the standard gauge. There's the top. And also the thing I like about this is come with spare parts as well, these locos. Comes with a spare horn. So if you have a horn breaking just replace it. And I'll have a replacement RS5T as well for my A A73, it's missing a horn. These ones don't have drives in the cabs like the um, A classes and the N classes and the P classes. It says, um, it's also like the N classes, it's got city names on the side as well. And all the notice boards on the side. So 
So, I'll show you a quick front view and I'm ending the video. And then putting it away again. Where's my NR5, NR8 in Sif National Ivory?